The wealth of evidence in this case is simply overwhelming. I always loved it when they said have. there's a mountain of evidence, trails of blood. Well, there was no mountain of evidence in my mind. They thought, we got our guy. They talk about trail of blood and this and that. Well, why don't you follow the trail of Mark Furman? O.J. Simpson does not have time to slaughter his wife, be surprised by a guy half his age, stab that guy a bunch of times by himself, and get away with everything, get rid of the weapons and the bloody clothing and whatever else had blood on it. If he did do this, he would have had blood in his eyelashes, for God's sakes. He'd have had blood covered in blood. And you can't be cool, calm, and collected getting in a limo 20 minutes after the murder. I'll give the government the best. I think it's 31 minutes from the murder to the time he's in the limo. I don't think it would be solved, but people have said, well, who did it? I said, well, I worked 18 hours a day for, I don't know, 17 months on this case, and forget about since then, all the times I've thought about it. I don't know who did it, but I know who didn't do it. O.J. Simpson did not murder two people. I've had people, friends, slam the table. You think everybody's innocent. I mean, just emotionally get crazy uh, over O.J. Simpson being innocent. I've had uh, almost a fist fight in my own backyard. A friend of mine's brother came down, we're visiting, you know, having a barbecue. This is way after the trial. This guy wants to have a fist fight with me. I'm just telling you what I think. I wasn't there, but I'm pretty certain this guy couldn't have killed two people, and here's why they want to hear it.